everybody. It's Mr. Hoff with Classroom Composers. And in today's video lesson, we're gonna learn how to form a clarinet embouchure. This will correspond with lesson number nine in the pre-method book. An embouchure is how a musician places their face and their facial muscles and lips and teeth on a, on a mouthpiece of their instrument so they can properly make a sound. Make sure your clarinet's built, you've got your reed on correctly, and uh, we're just gonna learn how our face is gonna work with the clarinet. We're not making a sound yet. The first thing that you're gonna wanna do is your top teeth, these two teeth, the top teeth are gonna bite down on the top of the clarinet mouthpiece, and your lower lip is gonna curl over your lower teeth, like this. Now, you wanna look at the clarinet and you're gonna to wanna to look for where the reed splits from the mouthpiece. That's where there's a little gap between mouthpiece and reed. So that location is where your top teeth are gonna to wanna to be placed. So that's about right here. So it's really not that much mouthpiece in your mouth. And that's where I'm gonna to wanna to aim my top teeth to land. So right about here is where you're gonna want them. Okay, this is too much, Boo. this is too little. But right about here where the reed splits. If you're not in the right spot, once we start trying to make a sound, you're gonna get a lot of squeaking. So, top teeth, you're gonna bite down with the top teeth. Your lips gonna curl over your lower teeth. And then, if you've ever seen a drawstring bag before, you're gonna wanna like imagine that the rest of your mouth is a drawstring bag and you're gonna wanna cinch it closed over the mouthpiece. So look like this, teeth, curl, and then cinch it closed. Make sure your chin is still looking forward and not looking down. And there's your embouchure. 